guys, one thing that you need to remember is that you cannot buy your tickets at the gate to get in. At least that's what we've been told in red. This right here is the ticketing center where you can buy your tickets. And then you can go up to the temples from here. Which are still a ways away. Like you still need to have transportation to get out there to the temples. But this is kind of still in town a little bit. All right, so here we go. Yeah. <laughs> He photo bombed us. We gotta buy tickets in here somewhere. There's all kinds of stuff in here. Big elephants. People wearing trendy tourist pants. Oh, thank you very much. Look at what we got here. Cool. Wow, so check that out. It has our picture on it and everything. All right, so we got them. Now it's time to go get back in the tuk-tuk. It's called a tuk-tuk here. It's a motorcycle with a trailer behind it. It can hold like four Americans or maybe like six really small people. And uh, we're gonna head up to the temples now and go check it out. Lots of places to eat in here. Looks like we're gonna get dropped off here. So guys, today what we're going to do in this video is just kind of give you an overview or kind of a summary of uh, some of the places that we see today here in this giant temple complex. And uh, what I'd like to do for you is make some individual videos of each of the places that we stop with our our guide or with our, our tutu driver guy. Right? He's gonna take us to several different places today. So I'd like to make one video for each of those places for you. And then today, just kind of give you an overview of what we've been doing, where we eat lunch, uh, the different temples that we go to and stuff like that. So let's go check out this first one and uh, see what it's all about. All right, guys, that is Angkor Wat, uh, one of the temples in this whole temple complex here. Uh, Sarah and I are gonna head back down, and I think from here, we've kind of seen this one, you know, the, obviously we can't do justice to it through the camera, so if you have the opportunity to come here, you should definitely come here and check it out. It's really interesting Amazing. and very huge. But we're gonna cruise down and go back to our tutuk, our little motorcycle trailer guy, and uh, we're gonna cruise off and go check out another temple. All right, so let's go head down get in the tuk-tuk and go to the next one. Let's go. We just finished up at Angkor Wat and now we're going on to the next temple which is Bayon. We were here, now we're going to this one. So a driver brought us over here to the restaurant. Check it out. Big, long tent area. Let's see what we're gonna get. So we're waiting for our food. Let's specifically find the bathroom. We haven't had a good bathroom review yet here in Cambodia, really. Because there's always so many people in there. But maybe today we'll get lucky. Let's just see if we can find them. Maybe these are toilets? They look like they might be toilets. Hmm, let's go see. All right. This is the squatty potty. 
Yeah. She said I couldn't use that one. I have to go up here. Maybe to the nice one. I don't know. Let's go in and check it out. Well, sorry, fail again. People in there. I know nobody likes to be filmed while they're in the bathroom. And so uh, we're cruising. And let's go back and see if our food's there yet. I think that would be good. Hopefully it is. We'll see. Oh, look at that. It's here. Cool, guys. How are you? Uh, what did you order there, Jules? This is... This, it said it was fried pineapple with chicken. Huh. I think it's kind of like a stir fry and then it comes with a scuba rice. So the kids and I are sharing that. That's cool. And I've gotten fried rice with shrimp here. Lunch is over. It was good. And now we got to go find our driver so we can go to the next temple. I don't remember the name of it, but it's on the map. This is what you do after lunch. You come sleep in a tuk-tuk. Put your legs over your dad. And just go to sleep. Sarah and I are getting a drink right here. Honey lemon and some water. Thanks, bro. Uh -huh. oh, I jumped the water and Seth went and got it. Thanks for saving the day. You're welcome. Okay. Alright guys, well he just dropped us off here. He said that we go down through this door and go straight through the temple. And then he will meet us on the other side. I'm so excited That's guys. Cool. This is the one apparently where they filmed the Tomb Raider. Or a piece of the Tomb Raider. I don't know, I never saw the movie. But um... They say that this is where part of it was filmed. So if you've seen the Tomb Raider, it's right here. All right guys, hope you enjoyed a little bit of that temple right there. And don't forget that we are making special videos for each of the places that we went today. And so those will be coming out like tomorrow and the next day and the next day after that. And so you can watch more kind of detailed information about those temples and see a lot more in the days to come, all right? And so uh, right now we're gonna go find our driver and see what's gonna happen next. Well guys, we made it back to the hotel and just kind of crashed out, just relaxed, took a shower, cooled off. And uh, now we're heading out to get some dinner. And I think some of these guys want to buy some souvenirs maybe. So we're gonna cruise down here and uh, see what we can find. I think I want to try and find some of those tourist pets. You know, like the big ones that have like the elephant print. You guys want some weasel coffee? <laughs> you ever heard of, uh, of um, What's it called? Coffee Luwak? Luwak coffee? Well, here it's called Weasel Coffee. Yeah, wow, there's a bunch up there. Wow, don't stand under it or don't open your mouth. Ducks. Oh, Ducks. Oh, wow, those are like full on tongues. Uh, huh? That's scary. And chicken feet? What's this? Those are duck heads. Oh, it's a bill. Oh, that's a duck bill. That's a duck bill. Oh, duck yeah. bills. Delicious. We found the place, guys. We're gonna eat fine Mexican food here. Oh, look what we got here, guys. Nachos. Everybody got their own appetizer plate of nachos. That looks good. Thank you so much. Why are we getting Mexican food we're in Cambodia? We've eaten a lot of Cambodian food. Like, every day I think we've eaten some type of Cambodian food. And, uh, it's it's not that much different than Indonesian food, except it's not as flavorful. Like Indonesian food to me just seems more flavorful, and you can't get good Mexican food in Jogja, so we're eating it here. So if you happen to be here in Siem Reap and you're looking for Mexican food because you haven't had it in a long time, 
Check out Villa's Mexican food here. It's pretty good. Just Google it. Location's really easy to find. So Jules is looking for souvenirs for people. I'm just checking out what they've got here. A lot of normal souvenir stuff. Carvings and wallets and bamboo things, all kinds of stuff. Wow, like this guy. Waiting for it to stop raining, along with all these other folks right here. Look at Seth's eyes, they match his shirt today. Green. Green, green and my hammock's green. Yep, and Seth got a green hammock. Hey, cool. my room. 